same Helen Mirren looking ever so chic at an, an ungodly hour. Yeah, no, really. I mean, what are the mornings like for you, getting ready for something this early? Morning person, late night bird? Uh, no, I, I'm not. I mean, uh, one of the things I really hate about filming is that you have to get up early in the morning, but I am used to it, you know, so we do do it. And you do know that the first five minutes is horrible, and then, and then of course, you know, you're up and you're, you're, you're getting on with it, exactly, yes. And, you know, none of the women in, in this evening, to, uh, in this, uh, this morning, early morning, I should say, in this morning, are um, strangers to get, uh, getting up early in the morning and doing what they have to do. They're all very achieving women and very successful women. And, and the only way you do that is by getting up early in the morning. Here, here, and one of those women, Adele. Now, you are obviously giving her this award or presenting her with this award, I should say. You won this award or received it back in 2010. So what does it mean to you to now be passing the torch to such an iconic woman in the industry? It's always, you know, it, it's always a great honor to um, receive an award from your peers, as they say. Um, and very, and when you specifically your peers or your fellow fellow women, <laughs> um, it it means that much more because you have a, a mutual understanding of the struggles and uh, that are specific to women. So um, it, it, it's very meaningful. So it's lovely for me to be here presenting to Adele. I, it's a massive honor. I'm sure that's her making. She'll be here. Some gotta be. What, why does she deserve this? Why Adele? Why? Rhetorical you question. Didn't say that? You know I had to ask it for the record. <laughs> why? Because it's Adele, that's why. Like, uh, yeah, yeah. And lastly, the end of the year, as you walk into 2024, what are you most grateful for this year and what are you leaving behind from this year? Oh gosh, that's a that's a big question. I'm certainly leaving the strike behind and everything. Um, you know, to have COVID and then followed by these strikes, it was very difficult for the industry at large. I'm very happy to be that that has been resolved and we're leaving that behind. And I'm looking forward to a year in my in, in my industry, in the film industry, that is is successful and productive and exciting. Happy New Year and have fun.